Hi guys, it's Simon here. As you've been following on from my videos that I've been posting through today, I'm now going to react to the Reading is Fundamental videos from Season 4 and Season 5. I'm literally going out all drag race. I mean, a third of my year has literally been over-swamped by the show. I'm expecting this week's Snatch Game to be good because I'm going to upload my reaction to that. And I'm also going to try and play along as well. But the problem is with my Snatch Game answers is that in my head I turn them into something dirty. So, here's hoping things actually go okay for me this week with the Snatch Game. Right, so let's move on to this Reading is Fundamental from Seasons 4 and 5. I think Willem's going to do really well as well as Latrice. My legendary children. In the great tradition of Paris is burning. Paris is burning. Get out your library card. Here we go. Like the minute you should be hearing Paris is burning, you'll know. Reading is fundamental. Uh, yes, because reading is what? Fundamental. fundamental. Oh, now, Here we go. Mini challenge, you'll take Why is this a mini challenge? It would be like an awesome, massive, major challenge. Indeed. Oh, he goes data. I don't know how to really read that well, so. Uh-oh. Does someone smell that? What? What is it? Oh, that's just Sharon Eagle. Oh! Jiggly Caliente. You should feel honored. The first contestant in RuPaul's Drag Race history with child. Oh! oh. Ouch. You're free now. You don't have to rock the yard sandals anymore. <laughs> you can't read the choice royale. Like, you just can't. Nice try, though, Data. There's lotion in my purse. You need to use them on your elbows and your knees. You look like you've been driving through flour, baby. Oh, um, dear. It's called Forever 21, not Forever 41. Oh, <laughs> well, that's true. Honey, your face is made out of marble. Don't move. Okay. <laughs> Good old Willem. Oh, no, oh, not baby. Me. You know, helium's for balloons, not your stomach. <laughs> oh, and, and, you know, Willem, I, I know you're talented. Like... Previously, like before I went properly through season four, I actually was okay with Ikuhara. I didn't agree with her like in episode three and four with her attacking Sharon Needles. But on the most part, I thought she was quite good. And in that first episode, I thought she would like be the love child of Beyonce and Rihanna. However, after I heard what she did with Jiggly and Dita in later episodes, like... I lost all respect for her. You don't slag off someone's way, deliberately sabotage someone's way in order to get them sent home. And to be calling... And she literally, like, called the black competitors in the competition the help. Like, who the fuck does that? That, like, that that was so rude. I'm glad Michelle called it out, her out on it, but... I'd have liked Michelle to lie into Fifi a little bit more. Actually, a roast of Fifi O'Hara broadcast on the Comedy Channel would actually pull in quite good ratings, so... Keep being nasty, Fifi. Keep being nasty. Let's hear what Fifi has to say about Willem. That, you know, buying shoes, but are you talented at, you know, drag? Uh, you know, Willem is. Sharon. What? I love how you rock the party city. That's where I got your Lady Gaga wig. <laughs> 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 Fifi was crap. Dita Ritz, I don't know if that is hot couture or hot couture, because there's holes in that shirt. Fifi, you are gorgeous. You catch the camera's eye from the right, but from the left, you snag it. Oh. <laughs> Chad Michaels, you so old. You still on MySpace.com. Oh! Oh, that was awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the RuPaul Ball. Tonight, in the category of Butch Queen, Dina Ritz. Oh, ouch. Jiggly, I love you. Come to Mother Dust. Come here. Come to me. Come to me. I won't hurt you. Here's yeah. my dentist card. No worries. <laughs> oh, dear. Bella loves to live his life and think that he's Carrie Bradshaw, but in the sequel, she'll be playing Scary Bradshaw. Oh. Oh dear. I wonder what the little bit from some. BMW body made wrong. 
Oh no. Oh my goodness. Oh no. Industry, congratulations on your new role as the big bad wolf. By the hair on your chin, chin, chin. Oh! Oh! Oh no. Two words. Sideshow freak. Latrice wins everything, hands down. You girls like to clock me for painting my skin on the gray side, but I was inspired by your knees. Ouch. Oh! Oh dear. Jiggly Caliente. You're such a fat slut. After sex, you smoke hams. Ah! Oh my goodness. Indeed. It's going to be between Latrice and Sharon. It's got to be. And the winner is... Who won? Yes, indeed. Oh my god, that was actually like that. That may have been moderate, but then Latrice and Sharon at the end killed it completely. Like that was awesome. <laughs> okay, now we're moving on to season five's reading is fundamental. This should be fun. I've already heard one against Coco, but Get never mind. Ready to visit the library, darling. Yay! Because reading is what? Fundamental. That's right. That's right. First up, I love this segment. Like, when they do it with season seven, it will be awesome. Oh, no, not detox. Roxy Andrews. Congratulations on the weight loss. But to me, you're still boxy, Andrews. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dia. Overbites are very in this season. Too bad your performance here is so under robing. Oh, 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 oh dear. Sharon Needles, what? No. Ah! I've had it. Jinx Monster. Oh dear. Oh, Roxy Jinx. Andrews. There are two types of peanut butter creamy and crunchy. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Detox. You won the challenge. You can take the chicken's mask off now. Oh. <laughs> Roxy Andrews. Coco Montrese. For someone who calls himself a top, you sure do like being on the bottom. Oh, dear Lord. Jinx Monsoon. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust. You're great at the challenges, but on the runway, you're a bust. <laughs> Detox. Not really, but... Is Amanda Lepore your mother? Because there's a lot of silicone going on there. Oh! Jinx mm. Monsoon. Boy George Carl. He wants his hat back. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Alyssa Edwards. Oh, great. Never mind. <laughs> I love that! New enters. Oh, I can't no. do it because reading you is like reading a Walt Disney book. It's simply too easy. Oh, <laughs> Love that. Sick. Honey, I know you think you're serving body and look, but the only thing I'm getting is the hills have eyes. Oh, no! Miss Coco, you must be blind because it looks like you're using Tang for your highlight. Oh, dear. Miss Alaska, I think you should wear a mask for every challenge. <laughs> that was a fail. I don't want to read these girls. I love them so much. All right, let's go. <laughs> waiting for someone to do that. Oh, oh, Alaska, well done. Detox. You're so seductive, but unfortunately it's illegal to do it with you because most of your parts are under 18 years of age. Oh, dear. sure the season of the fish smells like trout. Oh, dear Lord. Alaska has got to win this. Surely. Oh, I want to see one. Damn you, Logo TV. Why did you cut it off there? Maybe you'll mention it in the comments.
No, I'm going to have to check through the wiki article instead. Or maybe someone can comment it and I can save some time. Either way, doesn't matter, I'll find out anyway. Well, thank you for staying bad with me through the reading as fundamental reactions. I'll try and get back to you sometime either tonight or tomorrow because my schedule is literally going to be clogged. So hopefully I'll be able to post a few more videos before the school holidays are up and I have to go back to school. So that's pretty much it and there's nothing else left to say other than bye guys, see ya.